Good morning guys. Uh, it's like 9.30 or 10 and it's just hella smoky. That's why I came out here. At least it's a little bit better than other places, but a lot of the smoke has gone into the ocean. Hey, I'm just doing a quick uh, traction control test. I've got this little pile of sand and I can go over most light sand, but little fluffy sand. Uh, sometimes it gets stuck, so I'm trying to change the values. You can change it in VESC. Uh, enable traction control, you can um, mess with the values. So let me go ahead and uh, show you what I'm testing here. So you can see, uh, this is pretty deep sand over here, a couple inches. So I'm, I'm just keep testing until I can find the right values. But you can also do this if you want to test out um, your traction control. If it's off, it's going to be a lot worse, especially going off-road. You can just find some, you know, like, uh, try to find like a few inches of sand and test out your uh, off-road skateboard. Oh. So I keep getting stuck this deep sand stuff but it does fine um, in light sand that's actually and also another thing you can test with traction control if it's uh, set right it should be going straight right because that's how traction work, uh, works so let me go a little bit slower so I lost a little bit of direction there but um, that's something I can't avoid because this is like sand and it's gonna drift even with the traction control on. Uh, but let's go ahead and do some more tests. So if I go a little bit slower, it seems like I can go through a lot better. So maybe I was pushing it too much. Let me just go slowly through. So it seems like to work a lot better, I'm going slower through it. Of course, I'm not on it. Oh, now it's getting stuck. Now be careful, uh, if, you, if you don't have enough clearance, you're gonna break your belts. But you can see not too much sand is getting it. And another thing you can do is basically hold it up and clear out the sand by just blasting it. Demonstrate. I think it might be stuck. Just get all that sand out because if the sand gets between your belts, it's just not going to be good. So what I do is just lift it up, lift up your board a little bit, and just hold up. I'm trying to do this with one hand. It's, I don't want to get my foot stuck in there. Let's do it like this. Put it on top of these trays. There you go. Oh, what happened? Oh, something died. Oh, there we go. So let me just do it like this. So clear out all that sand. Because if you leave it there, it's going to get between the belts and possibly break, break your belts. Uh, when off already. Uh, the caps do help. I don't have the caps on there, uh, but there, there's, you're still gonna get a, a bunch of sand in there if you get stuck like that. Um, so always just clean it out. I just have it open because I, I don't have a belt cover that fits. Um, but if you if you don't get stuck, the sand won't get in it. Let's just do one more quick test and see how this does. It seems to be drifting a little bit left. Oh, that same spot. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm just gonna keep testing until it's perfect. But you do have to mess with the values of the traction control um, to really optimize it for 
whatever off-road you're doing. But sand is really good. Uh, it's a real good test. Uh, but I'll have to adjust the values a little bit more. Have a great day.